You don't look so good. What happened? The patient in 201 has just died. And Dr. Harcourt wants me to complete that certificate. So why do you look so perplexed? Well, I only did this once in medical school. We didn't spend much time on it, so I'm not really sure what to do. It's not that difficult. With the three or four deaths we've had recently, I've had to do a couple. So I can help you with that if you want. All right? Name? That part I can fill out. It's the part about what he died from is what I have a problem with. Hey, nobody killed him, so he died of natural causes. Okay, natural causes. Wait, hello, hang on. He was an old man, almost 60. It was about time for him to die. Then I'll put old age. Well, his heart stopped beating. So I could say cardiac arrest. But you could say that he stopped breathing. Okay, what you put is respiratory arrest. I've been using that one quite a bit lately. Actually, what I've been using recently is cardiorespiratory arrest. It has a nice scientific ring to it. Hey, I think I like that one. So cardiorespiratory arrest it is. As amusing as this scenario may seem, it does contain an element of reality. We who work in statistics have seen certificates completed by medical practitioners with precisely these